Hello guys and welcome back by another first look. This time I'm checking out Sugosis? Sugosis? I don't know. Rescue the animals. Yes, you hear no sound because I turn off the music. Copyright. I don't want that. So I just turn it off. Um, I've seen a little bit from of it on the internet and I'm quite curious. Re-entering October, so I needed to find a horror game that I could play, and I love zoo games, so I think this should be fine. I'm quite scared though, because I am a scaredy pants. I, I shit my pants quite fucking easily. Before we begin, I want you to put down your scribble. Um, non-disclosure agreement for night zookeeping of Pine Valley Zoo. Definitions of confidential information. Any information obtained by the zoo night by the night zookeeper during his employment is considered confidential. Non-disclosure obligations. The night zookeeper undertakes not to disclose confidential information to third parties during and after termination of employment. Limitation of obligations. In the event of injury or death of the night zookeeper while performing work duties, the employer is not liable to his relatives or other lawful represent re representatives. Term of agreement. Effective upon signing and is considered indefinite. Dispute resolution. The night zookeeper is or his lawful representative agree not to involve the police or other law enforcement agencies regarding death, injury, or other events occurring during work at Pine Valley Zoo. Let's not and waste time here. You'll be sitting here all night and I've got more important things to attend to. Any disputes shall be resolved through the negotiation before resorting to legal actions. Other conditions. Any changes to the agreement require written consent from both parties. Well, my name is Paul Conley, obviously, and let's do it. <sighs> September 6, 1991. You made the right move. Just a couple more things and you'll pull your family out of poverty. I really hope so. Attach this to your chest. Our scientists require us to do this to see everything that happens in the enclosures. Scientists? I thought this was a zoo. True. Never thought that the smart Alex belong right in the zoo. <laughs> Hope you got the joke. Excellent. Now let's get started. First, grab your personal PDA. It's necessary for interacting with all the work objects. Congratulations, you've taken the first step to becoming a part of our close-knit zoo family. Wait, what's this for? You'll find out later. Oh, are you finally awake? Good, get up. It's time to get to work. What the hell? What did you do to me? I took care of your health. Working with animals requires prevention. You wouldn't want to bring some kind of infection home, would you? By the way, I took your phone as well. I'll return it in the morning after the shift. So I got the job? I thought we had an interview. My wife is waiting for me outside. The job will be yours if you make it through the night. Let's go. I still have a lot to show you. Alright. I do not trust him whatsoever. Um. Oh, this does make me... Oh, let me see if I need to do anything about these. How do you say that? Come on, we're not playing The way it here. looks. It's a body cam view, but... It's quite spacious here. Yep, this is our hub. You'll have plenty of everything here, except time. Now we're in the cold room. Here we store herbs, vegetables, and fish while the meat gets ground into portions for the animal rations. And right now we're running low on herbs and vegetables. Got the hint? Get to it. You can find the instructions in your PDA. Right, load two or uh, one vegetable brick into the brick trolley. Okay. Oops. Right. Vegetables. Hurry up. Okay. Herb. How many did I? Two her herbal and one vegetable. Alright, so two herb, 
Okay, there we go. Most of the bricks will be left as a reserve. And take these ones with you. It's time to show you our workhorse. Okay. We have fish, we have meat. What was that? There's something in the works that you're not ready to know about yet. Let's start with the basics. Right, right. Um, bring the herbal trolley to break the train. And here is our K A T I E kinetic automated transport with innovative engineering. Katie will take you around the zoo. This is the refrigeration compartment. You need to load the brick trolley here. Until you load it here, Katie won't budge. To load the brick trolley, you need to activate the lever. Okay. Welcome aboard! Now, select the giraffe and load your own control panel and start the train. Look at all that bloody shit over here. Um... So what do I need to do? Go to the draft station. Okay. Come on, how much longer? A lot longer. I don't want to go there. Seat belts and sit up straight. Let's go. the giraffe station. Now listen carefully, I won't repeat it twice. This is our mobile veterinary station. Here you'll be mixing medications for our animals. Are they sick? Well, they can be. We need to closely monitor the health of the animals. We have some quite rare specimens, so the thought of anything happening to them is out of the question. Take this seriously and we should all be safe for another day. Follow me. This is our right. kitchen factory. To collect feces for tests, you have to feed the animal its favorite food. Here's where you'll prepare it. Choose the recipe from the list. Cut, mix, and you're done. Any questions? Yes. Excellent. The <laughs> zoo needs those who aren't afraid to ask. But even more so, it needs those who find answers themselves. All right, enough chit-chat. Go to the cutting table. Okay. You need to select the giraffe from the list. Press the cook button to go to, go to slice tree, okay. Um, so I need about half of everything. Click on the cut button to slice the herbs. Don't make a mistake okay. with the weight. The exact measurement is displayed on the weight indicator. Measure carefully. It's not enough, Paul. Add more. Excellent, Paul. Just go to the pharmacy. Cut. Now do the same with the herbal okay. brick from the recipe. Go ahead. One and a half. Should be fine. Please accept button. Cut off to nine one six. Well, that should be good. Perfect. Food is ready. Now activate the lever to lower the gadget trolley. Now drag the trolley to the gates. Okay. Zoo could be organized like this. A train? Trolleys? Yes, Paul, our zoo is quite unique. It's our pride. You won't see anything like it in others. Pride? But then why has the zoo been closed for the second year? People say the zoo is going through tough times. How would I know? I'm just a simple man. Clock in and clock out. How long have you been working here? Long enough to teach you everything. Come on, move the trolley. 
This is the entrance to the enclosure. To open the door, you need to insert your PDA into the enclosure terminal and select Open Enclosure. Okay. Welcome to the draft enclosure of the Bo, Poe, and Chloe. For leaving, make sure that all symptoms are detected. Creatures. Take the bucket and dump the food in the feeding area. Hey, honey. Hi. Oh, Lord. Hello, sweetheart. I didn't even see you, Bo. God. Alright, let's take a bucket. Are you okay, love? Where, where are your feeding areas? So? Oh, there. I missed one out oh, there's the other one. Come here, buddy. What's wrong with you, Chloe? Turn a bucket to the get the trolley. Okay, we'll do that. This game's crazy though. Oh lord. Alright, let's place that in here. Great. Now put on the MFE. What's that? Mobile Fecal Extractor. In simpler terms, a shit sucker. You've eaten shit before. <laughs> now you're going to suck it. I don't oh. know. Why do we need all this? We need to constantly monitor the health of the animals. And taking excrement for tests is one of your key tasks. A hundred thousand a year, Paul. A hundred thousand fucking American dollars. You just have to collect the shit. Come on, Paul. Don't chicken out. Vacuum of the feces. Okay. How do I know where the feces are? Hello, Poe. Why are you red? Oh, yeah, if you're pooping. I don't know, Poe. I got one poo. Chloe. Oh, here are the other two poos. There we go. You're still red. Why? Are you chilling out? Oh, that's so adorable. This is this is cute. This thermal. Can I see it? Can I make notes? Temperature deviation deviation from the recipe. Treating animals. If you had too much from the recipe, the animals might get sick. The risk isn't very high, but it's best not to break the recipe. I need to keep a track of how much the animal sleeps. Excessive sleep is a sign of illness. Seems the job is harder than I thought. Do I have do I have to make some comment? Question mark? Okay, return the NV. Oh shit. Place the catch in the front of the animal, measure the temperature until the data is recorded. Okay. You know. I need to carefully examine the bodies of the animals for scars. Scars indicate that something is wrong with the animal. I have to observe the behavior of animals. Zucosis can manifest itself in strange actions and weird movements of animals. Right. Now take the TIS. To avoid unnecessary questions, it's a thermal imaging system. You can just call it a thermal imager. It's needed to determine the body temperature of our animals. Is that this? Oh, it's this. Good. Now install it and measure the temperature of the giraffes. Alright, only a bow and Cleo. But Poe doesn't look that healthy, is it? Oh, 
Look how warm you are, man. Oh. You are hot. See? I don't want that. Okay. I didn't know it had it. Probably I will need all these things for work. I wonder what will happen if I apply them not just on animals. Okay. As you can see, one of the giraffes isn't doing well. We need to make a dart with Temperolax. It's a medication for normalizing the temperature of animals. By the way, it was developed by one of the local eggheads. Interact with the terminal and press the exit enclosure button. Aww. I'm gonna test you. Hello, Chloe. Can I pet you, love? No, am I not allowed to? Oh, fuck it. I pet a poe. Right. In the terminal, you can check all the analyses you've collected in this enclosure. Make some medications too. Well, you studied chemical technology in Indiana. You'll manage. Damn. How do you know all this? Trust me, it's not something worth being surprised about here. But I barely lasted six months there. Got kicked out in the first year. No worries. That should be enough to mix a couple of ingredients following a ready-made formula. <laughs> Congratulations, Paul. You've just come closer to success and the well-being of your family. Now, go and load the collected fecal matter into the biomaterial receiver. Don't carry anything into the car. Everything must be sterile. And don't forget to put the shit sucker back in its place. Right. All right. So we need to put this one... Let's go in. No, wait. Huh? Oh, we need to do that here, the feces? All right. Oh, now the door's open. It's alright. So, we got to bring him in. I don't know. What, what do we need to do now? Submit the feces for analysis. Submit the feces for analysis. Uh, submit the word, um, feces? Whoa! Why are you so jumpy? Now you need to load the trolley into the train. To do this, press the lever inside the car. Was I supposed to scare me? I didn't. Excellent. Now this is our mobile vet station. To make Temporalax, you need to load the station with enough vials. I did it this time, but in the future you'll have to gather the vials yourself to cook it up. But keep in mind, chum, there are not so many vials. Think twice before using them. Right. Prepare the temper, temper thingy. Temperlex. Okay, it's got it ready. I didn't read what the Perfect. temper. Now take the what? dart from the dart display. Cool, you've got Temperlex. Now load it into the veterinary gun. It's in the gadget trolley. Gadget trolley's here, right? Yeah, okay. Uh. Good. Now the only thing left is to dart the sick giraffe. Shoot the giraffe with a high temperature. What's that again? Poe? The sick giraffe, Paul. Be careful, don't confuse Poe with Poe. <laughs> oh, sir. 
So that's what the UV flashlight is for. I need to monitor the mucus description of an animal. So the presence of mucus is indicated a disease. Okay. The storage. I'm not allowed to go into the storage. Oh, I need to. I need to oh. Okay. Oh. You've cured all the animals. Okay. I'm sorry, Poe. I'm so sorry, sweetheart. Are you okay now? Are you okay now, Poe? Oh. Oh. Oh, is that because you shot you in the ass? So now, if I go out... Wait, what was this? Apparently, blood can only be taken from an animal in a stationary state. What's this? Animal can see when I'm aiming at them. I need to approach them from behind. Oh, yeah, good to know that now. My lord. So, congratulations, you've cured all the animals. Good. Little Poe is fine. What's that sound? I need to closely monitor the animal species. If they're changed in this tool, it indicates a disease. What was that sound? Oh, I see him standing there, so that's good. Door is open. So everything went smoothly? Seems like yes. it. I did this for the first time. Hopefully he'll get better soon. Well, don't doubt that. We need to get back to the hub. Alright, we need to alright, so we need this. And let's go back to the hub. Alright. to the exit. It's time to leave you alone with our lovely zoo facilities. Every zookeeper is entitled to a service car. This one's mine. If you perform well tonight, you'll get one in the morning. Is that your wife? Should I tell her you're staying here for the night? Keep in mind, I'll lock you in until morning. No problem. I think she'll figure it out and go home soon. As you wish. Good luck, Paul. Don't mess up. Alright, so I completed the tutorial. I have the penguin station storage room, the gorilla station room, and the graphs station storage room. So check the enclosure, feed the animals, and collect analyzers. Measure the temperature, measure the sound, submit blood for analyzers, submit feces for analyzers. What enclosure do I need to go to though? here who knows how long ago you're not answering calls i'm worried lily sweetheart sorry didn't hear you right away everything's okay 
They put me on probation, but I had to start immediately. You should just go home. I'll be back in the morning to tell you everything. Paul, but I saw them lock you up. It's not normal. Yeah, it's just protocol here. They took away my phone and made me sign an NDA. And all I have to do is feed and treat the animals. Oh, uh, and by the way, uh, there's plenty of meat here. I want my girls to finally eat normal food. I'll be right back. Don't go away. Oh, Lord. I need to give some meat to my wife. We've been eating only prepackaged meal for the most of the year now. It's terrible for a little Gina. Good meat break. But the thing is... says that the meat is not con contagious. Wait, why can I not go in there? How do I open that door? Take this one out. Did I open it? No. Take this. Give Gina a kiss from Daddy. It's time for me to work. Okay. Check the enclosure, feed the animals, blah blah yada 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 yada. What enclosure do you need to go to though? There's no meat. How do I know what enclosure I need to be off to? That one is locked. Um Well, that's fucking gross, but all right. It's not making me nauseous anymore, so that that's good. <coughs> uh, not allowed. Oh, but it's so much craven of that thing. That's mine. It's my zoo clothing, okay. Um. To be fair, I will end this episode. This was the first look. This was the first uh, part of what we can check in here. I need to figure out uh, where we basically need to go. I have no idea. This is one kilo, 0 0.1, 3 brick. What's the other brick? Also a three, okay. Should be good. Oh. This is what they eat. Still, I do not know which way to go. I want to turn the episode though. We do not have fish or meat yet. Use the right recipe for each animal. Everything that we have now is herbal and vegetable. Okay. Uh, but yeah, yeah. I, I will end this episode. Thank you guys for watching. I hope you guys liked it. And I hope I'll see you guys in the next one that I make. Bye-bye.